So we've got the mascara on, we've got the eyes done. The final thing is the lips. And again, I'm going to use Studio 10 lip pencil for this because it's pink. Um, the last couple of times I've used a cobalt one because we wanted a kind of bronzy one. But keeping in line with the colour scheme that we've chosen, and again, she's got fabulous lips, so we don't have to kind of update the up, 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 upcycle them. So we're going from the top down like that. Just put your lips together naturally. That's great. And again from the top and down like that. Remember, people said to me, dot to dot is a good way of doing it, but also put your, your little finger on your chin just to steady your hand. Please make sure that your lip liner matches the lipstick. Can you remember back in the day, Michelle, when we all did those terrible <laughs> dark lip liner? I know. And actually, do you know what? I don't know why we did it. But it's again, it's the old back in the day. We all also plucked all our eyebrows out. Electric blue. Electric eye blue shadow. eyeshadow. Absolutely. I did have a, a little fight with um, Princess Diana over that. <clears throat> and I did win the day. And it was me who talked her out of it. Anyway, dropping names. Boom. Um, right, so we're going on to pink lips. And I'm going to use a pink... Um, lip gloss as well. This is really pretty and just keeping it in tune with the rest of the face. Very very soft pink and as long as you keep it in this is a very safe colour because it's really works for most people to be honest um, but it's very very gentle soft pink and then finally Is it better to use a brush then? It the is, lipstick, yeah. I just always use you can use it straight out of the bullet once you've had it on mm -hmm. for a little while. Yeah. But it's always really good to actually get it on with a lip brush because it actually goes into every single right, nook and okay. cranny. And then after that, when you go out, just yeah, do it you can top straight it from the bullet. Absolutely. And then just a tiny bit of lip gloss. And these lip glosses are really good. So we're just going to pop that just in the centre. It's a Studio 10 one. And remember what I said, just pop it into the centre of your mouth rather than all over. Because again, I remember using lip gloss out of a tube and it was like a roll-on thing. Yeah. And um, yes, it you wasn't a good look. What, I was like greasy lips. Just it? Yeah, it used a to big just greasy yeah. palette. Right, so um, you can see there immediately what we've done. And I just want to do a little reveal. So... If she runs out the door and runs down the road, we'll just run after her. In fact, we'll the kids have just come out of school, so yeah. she's not going to get far. I'll catch yeah. her. Right, we'll take this off. We'll take this off. Oh, we haven't got one on that side. No, we haven't got one on that we'll side. We'll do the old... Um... <laughs> Thanks, Jo. I just wish I had just a little bit of her hair. Right, mm. go on then. Have a look. Da, 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 da. Okay, no, I really like that. I would never have gone for... Those colours. Those I don't colours. really wear eyeshadow, um, just because I, I don't know where to put it. To be honest, well, that, that is the main reason. That's the main reason yeah. why most people have a switch off. Yeah. And they'd rather not bother than look daft. Then yeah. that's the that's yeah. the bottom line. Yeah. No, it's line. usually just a mascara. And that's yeah. It. But look at the colour of her eyes, and look at the shape of her eyes. I mean, that's mm -hmm. that's what it's about. Well, she hasn't run out much. yet. No. Never haven't. Thank you, Joe.